you know, the problem is also public health is a it's a problematic field because you're preparing for things that you don't know if they're going to happen. And then if they don't happen, well, why did we waste all that? Why did we waste all that money on this stuff? Or if it doesn't happen because you prevented it, you don't know that it didn't happen. So then you don't know how bad it could have been if you hadn't pre prevented it. So then you don't see the damage. Like, let's take all the fluoride out of all the water. Well, we're going to see a wave of, in 10 years, kids with horrible tooth decay, especially in disadvantaged neighborhoods where they're not getting regular dental care or their parents aren't telling them to brush their teeth you know, twice a day. By then, it's too late for those things. Maybe we'll have a counter generation that will then have fluoride and water again. You know, But all these things have downstream effects that they don't seem to think, oh, we just cut the money now and there's no cost later, as if you know, it, you, you just save the money that you're not spending now and that's the end of the story.